first thing I want to do is express uh, best wishes to those uh, victims who are continuing to recover following the attacks of two weeks ago and to condemn the wanton violence and thuggery uh, of those recent events. There's no excuse for it, there's no place in our society. I'll be supporting the Minister because, as I've said to much media during the week, what I'd much prefer us to do uh, and focus on uh, as an entire House is to make the urgent adjustments that the people now require, and they're the working people of Ireland in the centre, uh, to see the adjustments to our policy on justice and immigration. On the Gardaí, the government must be less dismissive of the fact there is a morale issue, that there is a retention issue. The Commissioner must seek to build confidence that he has clearly lost. And in that regard, I'd most respectfully suggest that he cease his policy that seems to be continuing of the transposition of the senior PSNI south of the border, which in my view does not build confidence and morale among his own people. On immigration, I am in favour of immigration. I worked abroad and we must do everything we can in line with our capacity. Sadly, despite being advised by me and many others in this House, we persisted in this House developing a very unique, bespoke and outlier approach, particularly since the war on the Ukraine, that Middle Ireland is sick of. People fleeing the war in Ukraine will get €220 Euros a week. If I'm fleeing the war in Syria, I get €38 Euro a week. The Department of Integration, in direct competition with Minister O'Brien, has in effect contributed and driven the price of rent up 12%, making multi-millionaires out of anyone with a bed to offer. That has exacerbated our housing problems. Now, when there's an elephant in the room, mention it. I've been called a racist for mentioning it at every opportunity over the last year and a half. Colleagues, all of us need to welcome what we can, but wake up to the fact that there is no centralised European approach to this. Thank you, and we are doing much more than many other countries, and the people in Middle Ireland want to see us stand up. Thank you.